everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna be using every red art supply that I own. This is what they look like, and I also have this little jar bottle. I don't really have that many red art supplies. Like, I thought I was gonna have a lot more than this, but yeah, this is all I have. And I'm also gonna be doing my very first fan art on this channel. I wanna draw Sabrina from the Netflix original. I just feel like this color would be such a good representation of her, so. Well, let's see how it turns out. I'm gonna put the dark ones up here so I know what to do with them. So I'm just gonna go from dark to light and I'm just gonna line them up here. Let's start from the top. I got this really nice dark red color. Oh yeah. <laughs> you know, this one looks exactly like that. Oh, slightly darker. Here's the Bayanyo. I'm guessing this is gonna be way darker than these. All these are not gonna be in the picture, so we'll see what happens. I am gonna start off with pencil because I need something I can erase. Could have her face here. Her arms. It might have it be that she's maybe walking through the wood. I hope you guys know who Sabrina is because I'm just like. I don't wanna make her hat look like a Christmas hat. Could have this arm grabbing this. Her waist moving up. I can go down. Crotch. Um, I think I have something that I want. So the hat can be coming out of this frame, the same way her body's coming out. So I'm gonna start drawing her outfit. She's a pretty confident character, so I'm not gonna make her too afraid. Well, I'm not gonna make her afraid, I'm just gonna give her look I think I have what I need so now I'm gonna erase this a bit or at least just erase what I need what I don't need I mean I'm gonna start off with the micron so let's do this I know you guys have been asking for like hair tutorials but I'm so bad at drawing hair like I don't know how to draw hair it's hard and it's like really hard for me to teach something I don't really understand because I literally just go with what I think is right. I don't have like a method. I don't know. Oh, since her hair is going to be white and probably... Let's just see how much detail I can add in it with this. We got her down. Here, let's just outline everything with pen. I don't draw a lot of witches hats, so I don't know. I hope that looks like a hat at least. Yes, no, I think it does. To get a perfect line, I'm gonna get my ruler out. Okay, so I can have a bit of fog here. So I wanna leave these this area here white. Oh my god, what a weird tree. <laughs> um, yeah, <laughs> that's a tree. I'm gonna put this down and I'm not picking it up again. Maybe. Who knows? I might. Erase, erase, erase. I am gonna start off with this pencil. I'm gonna start off with her skin just so I have that done. And then her legs. I'm not gonna forget about that. I'm lightly just putting that red color down. Okay, I think that's all I'm gonna do with this pencil. Here's the next marker I'm gonna be using. Probably gonna just color her lips this color. And maybe also her dress. Say, this is it. I'm gonna color in her eyebrows. I don't know if I wanna color the backgrounds of these. Here, let's do that. So I'm avoiding the trees, I'm just coloring the back. Okay, I'm done with this pen, grabbing this other beyond your marker. Oh, well, maybe I should have made it lighter because it kind of goes in with the. And then I'm gonna just color in her tights down here. <laughs> Holy cow, I'm running out of things to color. Okay, we're done with that. This Prisma color. And I want to color in her eyes. Next thing is this Prisma color pencil. I'm 
try and draw her arms away from the background so they pop out a bit more. I'm just using the same color for her skin as well, just because I feel like it doesn't have enough detail. Another be on your marker. So I'm using this Copic marker to blend these two colors. I'm gonna use this Prismacolor marker for her hat. I'm gonna use this Be On Your Marker as well. I wanna see if I can get even deeper shadows for the hat. I have another Uhuhu marker. So there's that. We're done with this marker. Using this red marker here, and I'm gonna shade in her eyes. So this is the Copic Chow. I'm just using this color to add texture to the trees in the background. And then I'll color them in with something else. I'm picking this, what this looks like. Ooh, that is not what I want. Mm -mm. So I'm done with this marker. The next marker I want to use is this one here. So it looks like a lighter red color. So let's see what this looks like. Okay, I like this color. I want it to stand out against her outfit, so that's why I was looking for a light color. This looks almost orange though, but it does say red. <laughs> so I'm putting this marker down. Here, I'm gonna use this darker marker. I'm just going to use it to shade in her leggings. I don't know if I should color in her hair and then leave her skin or not. To do or not to do. Okay, I still have these. Let's see what I can do with this. That's it for that. Let's see what this marker is good for. More details to the trees. All right, we have four more red supplies. Let's see what I can do with this one. Next, I'm gonna take this pencil. So right now we have three art supplies. Okay, I'm gonna use this pencil to just shade in little areas of her hair. Two more markers. What am I gonna do with this? They're both Ohubu markers. <laughs> There's literally nothing I can do with this anymore. Done with that for the last one. Here it is. You're pretty red, aren't you? I'm just using this last red marker to maybe outline her, or just outline the trees. And then a little bit in her hat, just cause deep shadows, man, deep shadows. Oh my God, we're done. I've used all of these. <laughs> now to add in those little final details, we got our white pen. For some life in her eyes. Let's make her lips shinier. Don't know if I want to go ahead and outline her. I'm just fixing her hat. And then I think the hat is definitely going to need this around it. Oh my god, I totally forgot I still had this. <laughs> what am I going to do with this? I have a little Kleenex. I'm just going to put it on. Woo, too much. Whoa, 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 whoa. Honestly, I don't know. Just stab it on here. It's a look. Maybe a little more. I thought I was done. So 
so that's pretty much me using every single red art supply that I own. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you guys think about this. And let me know what the next color should be. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.